Drift funk is a funk subgenre, which originated in Russia during the late 2010s. The style is recognizable by its habitual usage of cowbell samples, heavy bass, and rap vocals, which are often sampled and end up buried in the mix so as to be nearly unidentifiable. Drift funk music when uploaded to sites like YouTube is often set to footage of drifting race cars, which I'm assuming is where the drift in drift funk comes from. Let's get into the cookup. Okay, we're gonna start off with the cowbell melody. And if you don't have a cowbell, do what I did and just download a free funk kit from Reddit. And we'll just paste that over. Now I'm just gonna look for a pad. The cowbell is gonna be the main melodic element of this beat. I just need something to layer it with to give it some more ambience. Now maybe we can find like a one-shot synth lead. Okay, maybe we'll add some more layers and uh, possibly some like accent sounds. All right, let's lay down some drums.
And I'm gonna route everything to a bus except for the base and the kick. And then I'm gonna degrade it. From this point, we could just select a random voice sample from a funk drum kit. Lick these nuts, drop down on your knees and so. But I'd rather use my own vocals just to make it a bit more interesting. It doesn't really matter what the content of the lyrics is, because the lyrics aren't really the focal point of these types of songs. So I'm just gonna freestyle a few bars over this beat. All this ice around my neck finna make my brain freeze. Putting them diamonds on the technique called it AC. Bit been hitting me up to date, she a straight freak. Giving me neck up in the stoop while I make beats. Ay, I got AIDS, I got rabies. Ay, I got AIDS with my babies. Ay, I don't know what I'ma say next. Ay, for your bit, we had great sex. Ay, oh, that's it. <laughs> I have the raw vocals loaded into FL Studio, and I'm just gonna use the first couple lines. I'm gonna route it to a mixer track first. I'm gonna change the pitch. Let's put a radio filter. And I'm going to chop it up. So we'll make that repeat. This is where we can start having some fun with the effects. That would be cool to come in partway through the beat. So maybe like this. I want the intro to have like a distant feel to it. This is a good one. You know what might be cool is like a record scratch. fire man and that's basically it all i have to do now is just mix it and make it sound a bit more polished uh let's see what we've come up with